Okay. Second part of our Gori Valley discussion. This is the Gori Valley mission, how it was designed a couple of years ago. Um, what you'll see is you have air support coming in from Kutaisi, coming in from Bilizi and Vaziani. And you got the Russian aggressor coming in from Nalchik and Beslan here. And um, yeah, so there's quite a lot of different units active uh, within this mission. But the idea was that there is AI which is being spawned at random times here from these air bases, which are doing a patrol or, or, an, or a round over the battle zone so that um, the players that are flying into the um, into the mission get um, kind of a, a dynamic uh, experience right there's AI there that can attack them um, and there's and there are defenses always present within the battle scene in the air um, then on the battle zone here what you see is there is a dynamic um, activity going on. You have, and let me sh let me search this for a second. Um, what you had was you had a um, different um, let's begin here. I forgot. Yeah, you had you had different. Um, spawn areas being created here battalions of tanks that were ready to be uh, defending that area and these battalions would be visible right so you had one here you had another there yeah and another i think it was somewhere in the middle here um, you had as well helicopters which were and it was also ai which were picking up um, all kinds of units here and we're dropping them into these landing zones here so that um, the helicopters would uh, would quickly bring out um, special forces towards the, the battle zone for for additional defenses um, the Patriots here the Patriot installations these Patriot Patriots here and they would defend the air and basically you need to enforce them with engineers you need to pick up those engineers from a from one of those two pickup zones and then fly them to one of these uh, Patriot areas to activate them so this is also um, a tasking system behind that uh, was dynamic and random um, and then of course the same on the Russian side here so you see a lot of units in this mission a lot of um, different tasks that need to be performed at the same time so it was kind of a complicated uh, mission to build and it has taken me at least a year to build it but now since i have this i think i'm not going to change much on the on the uh, setting about the units what i'm going to do is i'm going to replace the script so as as i do remember there were still some some switches here but now with the new Moose version, I think we can delete everything and just build one script um, in Lua and make this mission. And that's what I'm going to do with you in the next sessions. Okay? Talk to you later. Bye-bye.